little chicken in the crock pot. You're going to need some chicken breasts, cream of chicken soup, four ounces of cream cheese, half a cup of butter. You know it's going to be good when there's half a cup of butter in it. A tablespoon of chopped or minced garlic. I just use the kind in the jar. Three quarters of a cup of either chicken or vegetable broth or stock. And a packet of Italian dressing mix. And that's it. It just all goes in the crock pot. When it's close to being finished, it cooks for between six to eight hours. I'm guessing mine's going to take less than that because I'm only using two chicken breasts. You're going to shred that meat up and then cook your pasta later on. The pasta doesn't cook in the crock pot with the chicken. So here we go. All right, so I have two pretty large chicken breasts here and they're going to go into the crock pot. This is my four ounces of cream cheese and half a cup of butter with a tablespoon of minced garlic. I'm gonna add my zesty Italian salad dressing. This is just the generic Kroger brand. We're gonna dump in our can of cream of chicken soup. Mix that up. Okay, this is gonna go into our crock pot over the chicken. And then we're going to add our broth on top of that. This is the Better Than Bouillon, the vegetable broth. That's just my preferred broth to use okay. it. So when this cooks down, this cream cheese mixture is going to be our sauce. This recipe calls for angel hair pasta, which I don't have. And I couldn't find at the store last time I went. So we're using fettuccine instead. So we'll cook this up later on when it gets closer to being done. It's all in the crock pot and we're gonna let it go and I'll show you what it looks like when we're done. Okay, my chicken is done. It cooked about five and a half hours on low. I've shredded it and I went ahead and steamed some broccoli and put that in there. I just felt like we needed a vegetable. My pasta is boiling away. It's just about done and I'm gonna drain it and plate this my chicken mixture with the broccoli in it and I just drained my pasta. I'm gonna put that in. I also added about two ladlefuls, like this size, of the pasta water to thin out the sauce just a tiny bit. It was pretty thick. I'm gonna stir this up and put it in a bowl and a bowl of pasta and we're gonna see how she tastes. Broccoli, some chicken. Mm. This is a winner. I would make this again for sure. And this made a lot. I mean, I have probably enough to serve like six people. So we'll be having leftovers for a few days. Let's do a husband taste test and see how he likes it. He has no idea what's in here. Okay, husband taste test. I didn't tell him what's in there, so. It's good. You like it? Mm -hmm. That's a winner, huh? Mm -hmm. Not too salty, good flavor, mm -hmm. creamy. Yep. That's what he meant to say. <laughs> yeah, we'll be making this again. Husband approved. Mm -hmm.